I, What's going on? I'm really excited. It's the first fully charged live event in the U.S. We chose Austin, Texas for our first one. As an additional bonus, we brought an EV1, or more specifically, the local Oklahoma Electric Vehicle Association brought an EV1. So I flew to Tulsa and I road tripped down here with them, which was amazing because we towed it with an e-tron. So an EV towing an EV. So much fun. I'm already like, no matter what else happens, this has been awesome. <laughs> now, wait, now, is this car, um, now is this a non-functional, I know there was restrictions. This is a non-functional car. It's one of the three or 35 or 40 cars that were gutted and donated to museums and universities. This particular one lives at Tulsa Tech now. Coincidentally, it is one that I leased myself to somebody in Los Angeles on December 14th, 1997. My husband and I met working together on that program. He was an EV1 technician. So if you pop the hood, there's a little sticker underneath that has a recall notice or something on it that has my husband's handwriting. There are all sorts of little lovely sentimental layers in this car for me. <laughs> and the last time I saw you, you actually did drive an EV1 in Madison, Wisconsin. I did, and it was a very bittersweet experience. Really, really fortunate, but it made me miss the heck out of that car. Now, I, I, I don't know if this is public or not, but last night I was here, yep. I saw you getting pushed in this car. Sure. Is, is that movie magic where you're trying to do get, like a cool slow-mo shot or something? That was mostly us just being goofy. <laughs> but yes, well, while we were waiting to pull it into this room, we had it out back, which is basically the pit row of the Circuit of the Americas track. And so we had to have a little fun of the coincidence of this car being on the track, and we did. And it was just one gal pushing the car. Yes. Which, that's like amazing low rolling resistance. Well, and it's much lighter because it doesn't have a battery pack. So as it sits here today, it's about 795 pounds, uh, 1,795 pounds, just shy of 1,800. And so it's low rolling resistance. It's much lighter. It's really aerodynamic. And out on a nice, smooth, flat track, it was our camera person, Roche, that was out there pushing me. <laughs> So it's like a really cool Geometro XFI at this point. Just about, yeah. Yeah, Honda Insight, yeah. Uh, is there anything you're really looking forward to at the event? I'm looking forward to hanging out with 3,500 of my closest friends. Wow. <laughs> this is, this is, and I'm going to jump in here, and if you don't mind if I put my arm around you, just because we're all very excited to be here excited. right now. So this is very cool. Thank you for spending a couple of minutes Thank with us. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. Uh, I wouldn't miss it. Until next time, stay charged up. Okay, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Very well.